I was at work one day when this cat just shows up in the shop. What are you doing? There's always been stray cats around here, but Paul was different. It's like he wanted our help. I took some food from my ham sandwich and I left it for him. He was very shy at first. The next day I saw him at work again. He seemed really hungry, so I brought him a couple tins of cat food to where he was hanging out. First we would leave the food so he could have it away from us. Then he wanted to eat his lunch right by me. I decided to start calling him Paul. He started meeting me every day for lunch breaks. It's nice to have a lunch partner. Then he started staying, even after all his food was gone. When he jumped into my lap for the first time, it really surprised me. So I tried to pet him. And he snuggled right in. He became my work partner, always following me around the shop. I thought this is when I could bring him home. Oh, what's that? Come on with me. Yeah? He seemed keen on getting in the car to come for a ride. But once he was inside my house, he was not liking it. He wouldn't eat anything. And really didn't like being locked in a house. I didn't want him to escape or run away forever. So I brought him back where he was most comfortable. It can get pretty cold in the winter months. So I thought, and I built him a little house. It's insulated and painted a nice color. He has his very own office in the shop. Sleep in. What's up, Paul? It's been two years now. I come in and feed him every day when I drive up. And every morning, he sat there waiting. Paul! And he's so comfortable now, he'll take his naps on my lap. follow me around. It's great to have him waiting every morning and everyone in the office loves Paul just as much as me that they spend their lunch breaks giving him cuddles. He's home when he's here. He's the biggest part of our work family. 